Hello everyone, it's Homestar92, and welcome to more Let's Play Portal 2. In the last part, we did a lot of things, like a few test chambers. And in this part, uh, PlayStation Network is still down. That is another save that I had done. And this is where we actually were in the game. We had already made it to Chapter 3. So, I'm going to go ahead and load it up. And it'll be good fun. I believe this is where we were exactly. If I recall correct. So. Yeah, after this loading screen, we have what is presumably where I was, I hope. Test chamber eleven. These okay. bridges are made from natural light light bridges. that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing yeah. outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually do it. And of course these bridges, like anything else in this game, can be placed through portals. And that is an element that we have to use. Now that button is the first place we have to get, and that's a pretty easy task, if I do say so myself. You simply walk through this portal, and you're there. And that starts cubes a drop in. Now, we have to get in there, but in there is actually back there, I think, so I'm going to go through this. And my cat just came in. Hello, Mr. Kitty. Anyway, you can't see that, so you probably don't care a whole lot. Anywho. Basically, the test chambers are still fairly straightforward. You kind of have to catch this because it's not going to... It's not going to land properly. And the button is over there means we have to do that. And presto, bada bing, bada boom, just like that, we have a cube on a button. And now I cannot get back. Unless I do this. Which can work if you land it. And getting over there is a cinch. And Excellent. there we go. You're a Test chamber 11 and these complete. Tests are your prey. Speaking of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Did you guess sharks? And of because course. Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. I don't murder nobody people who are trying to help me, Gladys. Cruel. You were trying to kill me. I will murder someone who is trying to kill me. And of course, another loading screen, which is kind of ridiculous, because the PC version is just like this, and PC versions load off a hard drive. Loading screens should not be as prevalent as they are. Good news. I figured and out yeah, what to do my allergies are kind of bad. I should have taken a mucinex before I recorded this, but I'll when just have die, to live with it. I'm going to laminate your skeleton so we are on test lobby. chamber well, out of 20... Two. And that means that we are over halfway done with this part Perfect. of the game. The door is malfunctioning. I guess somebody's going to have to well, repair that too. I can't get through the door. No, don't get up. I'll be right back. So I guess Don't we just look anything. around. Because if I can't do that, what can hey, I do? Hey, up here. Hey, Friends it's Wheatley. Hi, Wheatley. Shut it right down. I ah! Bird, 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 Wheatley bird. is here to help us, I would assume. Okay. Hopefully. That's probably the bird in it that laid the eggs. Livid. And Okay, look, the point is, we're going to break out of here, all right? Very soon, I promise. I promise. I just have to figure out how. So Wheatley is, is not the most comes, competent person in the world, testing. though, so he isn't Remember, going to be a whole lot of help. I went and spoke with the door mainframe. Let's just so, say he won't be, well, living anymore. Anyway, let's see back to testing. what is in this room. 
we have a button in front of us. And I'm sorry about that. I was adjusting the brightness on my TV because I have to use splitters to get the picture through my capture card and my TV. And so it kind of ends up bad. But that drops a cube, but it drops it somewhere where I can't get it. So let me see what I can do. My orange is up there, so I'm going to move my orange here. Get myself over here. And then move my blue. And hopefully if all goes well, that happens. Now the button is down here. And that's a problem. So I want to be on the side of this portal that is closer to the source. Haha, <laughs> source. This is a game by Valve. It, it's funny, because it... Never mind. Some of you will get that, some of you won't. I don't need to explain it. It's a terrible joke. And well done. sometimes In you have fact, to duck you under your own so light well. bridges because you place them stupidly. In the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. And one there more elevator, room. of course. Enough. And we are already six minutes in. Wow. Time flies when you're having fun. Anyway. Guess what? More loading! Yay! Loading! Anyway, um... Yeah. So... This next test involves forward. turrets. You remember them, right? They're the pale I must say, it's nice to have my good TV back. I oh, formerly was... When I was at school, at times when I would come home, I all I had was my old 13-inch CRT. So, PS3 games don't actually look very good on a 13-inch CRT. Let me see if this works. Oh, okay, fine. I'll just kill you. That works, too. And you. You can die, too. This guy, if I remember correctly, has shootable floor under him. And, wow. Oh, I thought he survived. That would have been really bad if he had survived. If he landed just a particular way, he could have, too. And that's the thing. That's the thing that makes it possible. And, oopsie. A whole big pipe full of turrets. Isn't it sad? And here we are on the second level of this. If they honestly think this is hard after playing the first game, they're wrong. Because this is far from being difficult. They're so easy to knock over with cubes. And then you get the cubes back once they're dead. I mean, it's not like, you know, I can't ever use that cube again. One more turret is dead. And it helps to kill the far one, because he's the bigger threat to you. And you kind of just have to hope that your cube knocks him over. And there we go. Put the cube on the button. This is all pretty much rote repetition. I don't know if that word is actually applicable. I know I've heard of rote memorization, but well, I can't get across. That's unfortunate. That's darkness. Here we go. Sorry again about the allergies. It's it's that time of year. I'm sure those of you who get allergies understand completely. It's pretty bad. Um also, I'm sorry for the somewhat low quality of the video recording on this. Um, I normally use S-Video for everything that I can, but um, my S-Video cable is kind of occupied at the moment, so I can't so you may be confused about the passage of time. But the I can is, was your walk birthday. ahead, and I this is a lift, I believe. 
And I think this is completely normal, and here we are in the proper test chamber and all that good stuff. Now, as you can see, you have a reflection cube and three little things that you have to shine a laser through. The way I always do this is pretty simple. First, zooming helps make you a lot more accurate. As you can see, it can... D it... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry about that. It's, you know, as I've said, it's that time again. And there you go. That's one way to do this. There's actually a number of ways to do this uh, chamber. So, you know. Anyway, in we go to the elevator. And we're already past 11 minutes, which, as you probably remember, is the old time limit. So, I think this is a good place to split the videos. In the next video, we will do more Portal 2, but until then, I'm Homestar92, and I'll see you guys next time. Later!